I'm Nicole Wakeland and this is the Fastlane Car. And I've got the 2013 Lexus ES350 and we're going to talk tech. So one of the things that I really like about this car is how you navigate on the infotainment system. It has this little mouse-like thing right here. It makes a little beep as you move it along, but it's really easy to use and even has a hand rest. So as you're driving along, you don't have to be reaching or spinning for a knob. Just put your hand here and you have a little mouse, just like you use at the office all day, only it controls fun stuff instead of work. Another neat feature about this system is that you're not stuck with it looking quite the way that they made it look when this car came to you. If you want to change the icons, if you want to change things around a little bit to make it yours, you can do that. It's kind of like personalizing your phone. Instead of just being the boring blue cloudy sky, you can put whatever you want in there and then it's your infotainment system, so it's more personal to you. things that drives me absolutely batty is that once you start driving along, you can't adjust everything in the navigation system. Nothing makes me crazier than having to pull over in a gas station to figure out where I'm going. I know, distracted driving, but when there's someone sitting in that seat, he should be able to change where we're going. And we still have to pull over at a gas station or in the middle of some neighborhood somewhere where I don't know where I am. There should be a sensor in that seat, just like for the airbag. When someone's butt is in that seat, we should be able to adjust the nav system. Can you get on that for me, Lexus? Here's something that's not technically tech, but it is still a feature that helps your tech. On the dashboard here, there's a sort of like hooded piece. Looks like a piece of dash, doesn't do very much, except it shades that screen and it keeps the screen from being hard to read when there's very bright sun. This is one of the easiest to read navigation screens I've ever experienced. And even at night, it keeps the glow from feeling like it fills the entire passenger compartment, sort of keeps it contained, but still lets you see. So for the ease of reading that screen, that's a definite plus. So this is the 2013 Lexus ES350. Based on the tech in this car, on the Fastlane car's rating scale of buy it, lease it, rent it, or forget it, I'm gonna give this car a buy it. It's simple, it's clear, it's easy to learn, and it makes driving a lot more fun. I'm Nicole Wakeland, and this is the Fastlane car.